This is Jimmy in Mexico, and I want to show you how I have my my uh, armor plating vest set up. I don't on this particular vest. I don't have the the crotch protection, but I have the the plates, and you know, and it has Molly, and have my admin pouch, you know, and little blood type tags on here. Got a little um, light right here for you know admins. I can kind of look at some different things. Kind of helps. I've got my patch on here. Now this this uh, vest here, plate carrier, is made by Proper. Well, up underneath here, there's a little bitty tab right there. And I think that's way too damn small. So in case you get shot and you need to get out of this, I tied some paracord on to the strap underneath there. Run it through there and I tied a knot in the bottom of it. So this piece right here I can get my hand in that even with a glove on or whatever and I can pull that out and I can drop that plate carrier now I'm not saying that I'm going to be dropping my own plate carrier but that's a good idea right there for people who are going to wear body armor and may need to get that plate carrier off in case you have a wound and you need to stop a sucking chest wound or apply bandages to something I believe in you know your personal egress you know from this equipment and everything is important Okay, um, now I bought the plates from a local army surplus place here in town. bought the plate carrier there also. And on the back, what I have set up here is I have some of these uh, Grimlocks set up here. So they fit just perfect for me to take my water bladder, my bladder carrier here, and I can strap this thing right onto the back of my plate carrier and I can, you know, I can run the hose up over the shoulder and, you know, and run it through the straps and everything. And I've got my water bladder that I can attach right to the back of this plate carrier. Now that gives me something, you know, that I can carry. I have a few medical supplies and different things that I carry with me in here. But mostly in my water bladder, I just have water purification tablets. I've got my um, iodine drops that I can put in the water. And I've got a little bit of repel gear that I have in here just because it's really easy to get to. And there's one little pouch right here on it. And so it, I just have, you know, a few things in this. But um, then I have it set up where I can carry this on my assault pack. And I can carry it on my main carrier. My, and I have the, the new FILBE marine system. And I really like this system. I'm really impressed with it. There's a lot of thought that went into it. And I'll make a video about that, you know, but, but this, this is really nice that I can strap this right onto the back of my, of my bulletproof vest, plate carrier. And, of course, I will eventually try and get some plates for the side and work them in somehow, maybe, maybe have some plate carriers set up so I can put the side plates on here, you know, but, but for the time being, I, you know, they're kind of small plates, they're, they're, or they're large, and I needed probably an extra large if I can get them so that I can cover up here you know, a little bit higher and get a little bit lower. But, but for the time being, you know, this, this is a, a good rig. It's set up for me, and it's, it's easy to carry. It's not real heavy, and I do have a, one of those, uh, all that nasty-looking... Um, gray army type stuff name slips in my mind but um, some of their stuff that I have a, a full deal with and it has the soft armor crotch protection shoulders neck everything and you know I would hope I wouldn't have to get into a situation with that but but mostly just for my use this is going to be you know my uh, you know trying to get to somebody get them out of harm's way type of deal and uh, you know, I can, I can put a, a holster on this thing, you know, later, and, you know, if that, if that need arises, but in the meantime, you know, just for my basic EMT stuff, this is good right here. I also have some little, um, these elastic deals here, I can just put on a pair of trauma shears, I can bungee, you know, they're just with a little piece of shock cord on there, but it's woven into that. I can put my trauma shears on there, I can put a flashlight in alongside on this this uh, 
little admin pouch put a few things up here inside this you know but for the time being you know this this is just this is just basically just a chest rig but I have a a stomp 3 medical kit that I carry all of my other a stomp 2 medical kit and then that's where I carry everything else in but I just wanted to share this with you I don't know I mean if you all have some better ideas on how to set up your 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 uh, armor plating and everything I know that a lot of people you know they would probably have mag pouches and everything on the front of it and you know and that may be the case whenever things go south on us but for the time being you know just going this route right here but uh, please rate this video give it a thumbs up share it you know and uh, leave your comments in it and everything I'd like to hear what your opinions are thank you very much bye